When full-scale hostilities in Ukraine began in 2022, the EU stopped taxing the vast majority of Ukrainian agricultural imports to help support Kyiv's economy. But that incensed the EU's agricultural industry, which claims cheap imports from Ukraine are undercutting the price they can get for their goods. Polish farmers blockaded checkpoints with their war-torn neighbour, and Belgian farmers drove tractors into the centre of Brussels. While there's convincing evidence Ukraine's agricultural imports are not what's driving prices down, an unamended deal was unpalatable to politicians facing intense pressure from farmers demanding safeguards. So this new proposal puts a cap on how much poultry, eggs, sugar, oats, maize and groats can be imported into the EU from Ukraine. But it didn't go as far as France and Poland would have liked. They wanted Ukrainian wheat added to that list. This latest proposal will be voted on by the EU's elected lawmakers in April. They could still choose to reject it or demand further changes. They'll have an eye on European Parliament elections in June and the bill's reception in their constituencies. Stuart Smith, CGTN, Brussels.